So just a very quick check in on Princess Catherine energy relationship with William. Obviously all the photo and everything coming up. God, I'd hate to be her. What a nightmare because of a photo. Can you imagine? You can't do anything. Right. Let's see how. Well, I can't imagine she's feeling that great. Can you? Let's see her current energy, her current energy in herself. How is she feeling? How is she feeling? How is she feeling? Okay, 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 okay. How are you feeling? I do feel there is definite pressure from somebody um, in the royal family to do the photo in the first place. Keep up happy appearances. We, I don't know. I know um, William is a Cancerian like me, so he's a water sign. This is coming through as an air sign, but it can mean air personality, which means somebody that's very authoritative. They don't mix their words. They will say exactly how they feel. They would just tell it and they can be very blunt. And I feel this is somebody older than her that's kind of put the idea across to play the happy families card happy families card especially with the sun which is happy pure happiness bliss oh it's amazing everything's great i do feel there was that pressure put there towards them and then we have the creative aspect as well which i believe is the photo putting the work in to do this and she didn't really want to do it i don't feel it, it, it's more because it was expected of her and I'm hearing a false show. So a false show, you know, obviously we know the photo has been edited, but people saying it's AI on her face and things like that. A false show of happiness, basically, is what I'm getting. Put put on the someone's pressured her to do the photo, get it. And they probably do it every year for Mother's Day, Mother's Day anyway. OK, that's what the royal family usually do on special occasions, birthdays and things like that. But I feel there was a lot of pressure on her at the time to do it. And she felt in herself it wasn't kind of right because she wasn't feeling good in herself. And just, oh, yeah, smile, be happy, make sure the whole world knows everything's OK. She's not feeling great. Hidden emotions and feelings about doing this. Not that happy about doing this. And the Queen of Wands energy here. Let's see how she feels. Let's see the relationship, first of all, between her and William right now. I know, I think last time I read for them, I'm not going to go into people's sex life, guys. <laughs> Queen of Swords, not feeling it right now, for sure. Um, but there were worries about the chemistry aspect, and I thought it could be because of the surgery and health issues, which is very natural, but let's just see what's going on there. How are they currently with, the, with each other? I do feel she's not taking any crap right now because she's coming up as the Queen of Swords, which means saying, I'm hearing telling it like it is, telling it like it is i feel she's got pressure to do things um and make appearances before she feels ready mentally as well and i feel william is this i'm hearing william's the scapegoat to tell her these things so you know we should be doing that you should be doing this can we not should be but encouraging her it's like words have been spoken to him to encourage her to get back on it kind of thing get good but get back on the wheel on the cog i'm hearing on the cog all over again she doesn't want to she knows this is probably the only time out she's going to get ever in the future with the royal family when it comes to appearances and things like that. This will be the longest break she can ever have. And because it is surgery, she can get away with having that break, which she needs. It's not like, oh, you know, you take a week holiday and then, then she's back on the cog, back on the wheel. I keep seeing a wheel going on and on, steady, churning, tiring. She's knackered. So this is the only chance she's got to really have a, a, a reprieve, a break. I really feel that. So right now she's like, no, I, I need my time out. I need my time out. Now let's just see how the relationship is because I was a little bit worried last time, but let's see. He was obviously there for her in the hospital. We saw that him being her rock, but at the same time, we still had the chemistry aspect and worried about their love life and the physical closeness and things like that. So how does she feel? She's not happy. I wonder what Camilla is. Is Camilla a fire sign, a fire personality? It looks like Camilla coming out here. Do you know what? It, it's coming out less about William and more that he's William's been pushed into doing these things or talking her into things before she's ready. 
because we have the judgment card here which means literally i don't feel this is the world judging her i do believe the royal family nobody would take a break for that long i don't know if the queen had surgery before but she was back on it back to work sooner or something along those lines and i feel these lines are being used on her you should be back on it by now we have the judgment over her not working this is the working card okay and then we also have her actually just trying to take time out to work on herself to heal and get better it's like she people are trying to push her in before she's ready she's not ready i mean the death card it's like she just wants to put a stop to all this right now that the the pressure and again i just feel she won't feel like she's going to get another break once after this you know like this sounds terrible but i'm really sensing that she knows surgery is an excuse not an excuse but a good reason for her to have a long break right now and she's not planning surgery in the next five you know you don't plan surgery or something to happen to yourself she just knows this is her chance to rest um going forward again i see this person we saw earlier putting pressure on her i don't know if this is charles and camilla but we have this couple putting pressure on her she feels hidden feelings and emotions towards it she's she's like grief she's not ready to move on and go back into the limelight right now but she has to do it and obviously the money card coming in as well the money finances the work card bringing stability back into the royal family so overall do you know what i thought this would be about william i thought this would be about william but it's actually more about i think it's not charles and camilla other people in the royal family that are trying to i'm hearing coerce so they're speaking to william and trying to make william push her more and that's what she doesn't like right now <sighs> scapegoat i really feel william is a scapegoat right now in all of this and he could end up resenting the fact that he's the one being on show the show pony oh i just heard show pony so it's like he's the show pony now and she's not and she should get back on it i do worry for them though i worry for her anyway i worry for her last thing let's just have a look a couple of cards looking ahead for her her energy how she's going to be feeling let's just have a quick look energy in the future months energy in the future months energy in the future months cocoon i do feel she just wants to be in a cocoon with her family right now she's just over it all cocoon i hear cocoon time out cocoon wrapped in cotton wool just just wants in a way nothing to do with the outside world right now right cocoon let's see now this isn't the best cards right now now, what I will say that does look positive, it looks like William is coming out now. Thank God for that. Let's just keep this going, please. Okay, okay. Stand her ground. Okay, well, thank God for that, because we did have the William come up here. Now, this is the relationship card. This means heartache, sadness over the relationship. So, yes, I do feel they're having struggles right now, especially with this, which is the priest, the marriage card. Their marriage, their relationship, struggles, heartache. So, yes, they are going through it. What I said is good about it is with this six of wands energy, it does mean they can overcome all these difficulties. This is like going into a battle, into a war, and then working it out and coming out okay. And then when we look ahead at the future, we have the Empress, which is, um, it's like the fertility card, but it also means abundance. Now, I did a reading for her in 2024, and I said they were on about, there were talks about her having a baby, and everybody got really excited, and I said don't see a baby is yet it's more talks about it and last chance like she knows it's the last chance and i do wonder now that this was the conversation before she had surgery like this could be it now you know so don't everyone get really excited about the baby this means abundance i feel they've already had the ch chats before she went into surgery so and they were questioning that this is probably it you know and then the surgery happens so other than that the temperance does mean balance we have abundance um again fertility but we have the temperance card, which means more balance and peace coming in. Justice as well. OK. Now, for me, this is also justice for past deeds, that past work paying off for her. But I will say she is going to be stronger. Seven of Wands means she's really going to put a, put, this is a blocking card. Like, no, you're not doing it. Get away. Not, not having any of it. She is going to be blocking things she doesn't want to do in the future. I feel her mum, is it Carol? I think it's Carol, has had a chat with her saying she has to start putting her health first over the royal family. 
and this is blocking things now again it's not always prince charles and camilla remember they're on a roster as well there's people telling them what to do people that work in the pr for them say this is good you should do this you should do that i feel it's more against that because again even camilla and um sorry guys can i just say prince charles a million times even camilla and king charles on that cog or on that wheel it's inbred in them it's just what they do camilla is a bit more has sympathy for kate i feel because she wasn't bred like that born into a royal family like that where she has to have duty so she kind of helps charles i think like relax a little bit and i think kate's a bit like that too and i just see that energy coming through with kate in the future putting her hands up more and saying no i'm not doing that i don't want to do that it's not me it's not what i want to work on personally so i do feel she's going to come out of this stronger mentally as in against the protocol the protocol i'm hearing um, and I do feel they are going through a rough patch, but they should overcome it, okay? Um, but yeah, there is a rough patch at the moment, and she feels pressured to do things that she doesn't want to do right now. Like I would be if I just had surgery and the whole world is on about bloody photo. Oh. Anyway, that's it, guys. Take care.